Upon arriving at the showroom of Audio Video Systems, one enters a world of sensory images of sight and sound that has to be experienced to be believed. Owner Kip Davis has created a variety of displays that range from basic stereo systems to sophisticated, fully automated high-end home theaters. Davis's business, which originally began as a home entertainment installation enterprise, has now expanded to include residential and commercial television, telephone, and data wiring, lighting control, video surveillance, security systems, and most recently, central vacuuming systems. We're here today at Audio Video Systems in Angola with Kurt. It's Shelbourne. Shelbourne. Yep. Shelbourne. He works in design and sales mm -hmm. here. Yes. And tell us a little bit about your company and where you're located at. Sure. Uh, we're just a mile off of 69 right off of U.S. Highway 20 up in Angola. Okay. Uh, we've been around for 10 years. And, and tell me real quickly, uh, what do you do? What do you guys do? Uh, basically, we do everything in the home for audio, video. Okay. Um, we do the structured wiring, which would be the phones, data, Cat5, sound. Uh, we also get into security and surveillance, um, and also home theater. Okay, and certainly when we talk about technology, we have to talk about structured wiring. And I'm standing here next to a structured wiring panel, as I understand it. Absolutely. And maybe you could tell us about some of the components in this box, and where you've set this box, and so on. Sure. Uh, this box normally sits in a mechanical room. This okay. is where all of your phone and data cabling would be ran in home run two. Uh, the TV cabling would start here as well. We actually put in a surge protection. And it's also a whole house DSL filter. What else might be in this box? Uh, we put like the modem in the box. Uh, we also have a splitter here for your cable. We also have the disconnects for the uh, security system. If you have a security system that would dial out in the case of an emergency, that is also in this and, box. And so this is real important if you have D DSL in your home or you want DSL or if you want Fios in Fios, your home. Fios, absolutely. This is all important. Yep. And is the quality of the wire that you run important to that? Uh, we use Cat5e. Okay. Uh, it's high grade. Cat5 enhanced? Enhanced okay. is what Cat5e right. means. Uh, that we run to each jack. Uh, that jack can be a phone jack or a data jack that way. Okay. And as we think about cost of, of a structure wiring package in a typical home, can you give me an idea of range, what we're talking about? Um, in a typical home, it really depends on the amount of jacks you put into the home. But a okay. typical home, somewhere around $1,000 for you know, phones, TVs, and the uh, panel. And, and I think you mentioned, Kurt, that around $35 for additional outlets. Absolutely. Which is really yeah. reasonable. If you're going to do it, you need to do, do it, it up now. Front, don't you? <laughs> it gets That's expensive great. later.